Hi, I'm Jacques Pépin. Today, a classic French dish from brasserie or from home, the onion soup. Onion soup, but onion soup gratiné. That is, you may go to a restaurant and you have onion soup, and the onion soup will be just the broth and the onion. It has to have the word gratiné, that is, to do a gratin, sometimes short, but just call it a gratiné, which is what I'm going to show you. We have three tablespoons of butter here, a dash of olive oil, and uh, a lot of onion in there. So, I would say at least, and this is for like, well, six people. Uh, can do it less for four or two, but I would say that you need at least three, three to four cups of onion. Finely sliced, you can do it in a, in a food processor. And there is a different way of doing it. I remember in Lyon, we used to do it by browning the onion a lot and eventually putting a little bit of flour on top of it to thicken it. But conventional way, you don't do it. I would say that, I would say I have three cups of onion right there. If you have four, if you have two and a half, it's fine. Dash of salt, dash of pepper, and then this is has to brown. And it has to brown for like, I would say 15, 20 minutes. Uh, yeah, yeah, 20, maybe even 30 minutes, I mean, until it's nicely caramelized. It changes the whole taste of, uh, of the soup if you do it this way. And of course, we have six cups of chicken stock here. We add to it. But for the time being, it has to brown. What we do also is the crouton to go with it. So I have crouton right there. And what you do, you cut bread about that side. You know, roll it thin, that's it, in the oven. 10, 12, 15 minutes to have a nice crouton, very crunchy like this. That will go with it, and with that, grated Swiss cheese. So that's it. All we have to do now is to wait until the onion is nice and brown. Okay. Now you can see those onions are really caramelized now. And that's what you want, sweet onion. So what I'm going to put in there, some of that stock. Deglaze my pan. And then I break the onion in there. Okay. Six cups of stock in there. And that can come back to a boil. And just boil a couple of minutes, that's it. Now I want to make sure that it's properly seasoned. That's good. So as I said, you can go to a restaurant and you ask for an onion soup and you may have just this. If it's gratiné, then it's this, plus the bread and the cheese on top to do a gratin, that is a crust on top of it. Okay, so that's what we're going to do now, here. So, this is an onion soup bowl, and I like those with or without the handle, particularly, but with the lip here. See, very often, I have seen people doing it in this, and it works to up to a point, because this is straight. So often the crust doesn't stay on top, it's kind of slide down. And this is the reason why you want to have this one with that lip here, so that, so that the, the, the cheese stays stuck on top. So I would say probably three, yeah, I would, three croutons. You can have it as thick as, as, thick as you want. Okay, and that goes into the oven 
also have to, not under the broiler, as sometimes people do it. In the oven, it takes longer, but you get a better crust. So here, I have a fair amount of bread, as you can see. Some of the cheese goes uh, a couple of tablespoons, maybe, here. All right. And then we put onion soup. And you really want to kind of fill it up to the top. Yeah, just to have some space for the cheese. Okay. Those bowls are mm, about two cups. Huh? Two cup bowl. So that's uh, a meal in itself when we do it at home. That's usually what we have for dinner. As you can see, my six cup here, with the onion and all, is making four onion soup. Right. At the end of it. Good. And now the cheese on top. I want to have enough cheese so that it stick to the side. And at the point of having the lip. Uh, okay. I like to be very generous with the cheese because I love with cheese. That's it. That goes into the oven now. About 400 degrees and it's going to cook. Mm, I would say a good 30 minutes. Here we are. The real onion soup. Gratiné. And if you want to burn your mouth, you eat it right away. But <laughs> I uh, like to have it hot so you have that crust here on top, you know. And of course, so the long pieces of cheese. In Lyon, where I come from, we make it in a big bowl like this. And you know, it's a kind of custom when you go out, when I was young, going out for dancing or whatever, at two, three o'clock in the morning, you go to a restaurant to have the onion soup, it's done in a big one. So what they do, they mix a couple of egg yolks with some port wine, they make a hole in the center of the big onion soup and stir the whole thing together. Look like a mess, but it's really good. Mm. This is hot and good. Mm. I hope you do it at home. Thank you for watching.